<clears throat> so um, here's the latest uh, news when it comes to um, our warriors, our fighters, um, Klitschko, the Klitschko brothers, uh, Vasily Lomachenko, Alexander Usyk. Uh, if you guys don't know Alexander Usyk, um, the latest of the three, I believe, or the latest of the four, I believe, uh, to join um, the defense, Ukraine defense against the Russian invasion. Uh, I, I want to say this before I uh, get started. Uh, look, when we speak of um, celebrating, I don't Cinco de Mayo, um, Mexican Independence Day, Fourth uh, of July, uh, Independence uh, Day uh, in the states, um, any form of independence or freedom, uh, Juneteenth. Uh, for African Americans in the States. This is what we're talking about. Okay. A fight for your freedom and independence. Uh, which is why I never give those things um, an eye roll. Uh, or those celebrations an eye roll ever in this community. Okay. Um, and I, I, I take it very seriously because now we're here. And this is a current situation. Um, and also a reminder on how important independence and freedom is uh, for uh, groups of people, okay? Um, and human nature. So, um, if you don't know, um, which I believe you guys uh, do know, um, the Klitschko brothers um, immediately uh, defending uh, Kyiv, um, which is the Ukrainian pronunciation of the capital of Ukraine, which Vitaly Klitschko is the mayor of. Uh, picking up arms, defending uh, the Ukrainian uh, capital. Uh, now, uh, Alexander, Us uh, Alexander Usyk has joined the Klitschko's over there in Kyiv um, as a defense against Ukraine. And I really just heard about Alexander Usyk late yesterday. Um, Vasily Lomachenko, on the other hand, uh, I know for a moment he left to Greece and he has come back uh, to join the Belgrade uh, Dniester Defense Battalion, where he's also there to defend Ukraine. Um, incredible. Uh, fighters fight. Okay. Fighters fight. Also want to say not only has this been just a huge, uh, uh, devastating, uh, costly situation here, um, as far as the boxing community, this has definitely thrown uh, a Charles monkey wrench in the boxing schedule when it comes to Usyk and Lomachenko, uh, specifically those two being uh, active uh, fighters uh, fighting to defend Ukraine. Um, we know Usyk, June, I believe, uh, his fight uh, to defend his unified titles against Anthony A.J. Joshua. And then uh, Vasily Lomachenko signing uh, his end of the deal to take on uh, George Kambosos Jr. for his unified titles, uh, June as well. Black Two Sugars. Let me give out Black Two Sugars. Um. If I was George Cambosis, at least, I know that he has uh, a few options here on who he would defend his titles against. For me, it would be a no-brainer at this point, Vasily Lomachenko. I will hold out. I will wait for, if I mean, you can't wait forever, but if everything goes well, um, as far as as little casualties as possible, and they and Russia and Ukraine can come to some kind of agreement, um, what an honor would it be for George Cambosis Jr. to sign his end of the deal and say, look, I'm going to take on Vasily Lomachenko. Um, that, what a tremendous honor. Uh, I want to say this also. Vasily Lomachenko and Alexander Usyk has now joined that very rare list of uh, boxers who have served for their country um, in the military. You have Willie Pep, uh, Joe Lewis, 
uh, Rocky Marciano, Sugar Ray Robinson, Max Schmeling, um, my brother, uh, Jamel Herring, serving two tours um, for the States. And now you have Oleksandr Usyk, um, Vasily Lomachenko. I mean, just joining other warriors, and that's a rare list of warriors uh, serving their country. Um, fighters fight. Now, there is a, the latest news is there's a bit of a light at the end of the tunnel here a little bit. Um, hopefully, the very short tunnel. Uh, Vladimir uh, Zelensky, uh, president, Ukrainian president, um, he's announced that they sent a delegation team um, to delegate, delegate with Moscow on the um, uh, border. Uh, the U Ukraine Belarus border um, talk. You know, hopefully uh, something can be. Um, and and there's no preconditions with this delegation. Um, hopefully, this is the beginning of slowing down the invasion or stopping the invasion altogether. Um, talk it out, negotiate. Uh, man, this this is just, it's heavy. It's heavy, especially going visiting social media sites and seeing video and just, it's one thing uh, to be here miles away, um, hundreds of thousands of miles away. It's another thing, You uh, the internet has made, has really made the world smaller and to see things um, that I've seen, it's very scary. Um, about to turn on the news now, uh, get updated on all of this, but I did think it was my responsibility because you guys know that I don't speak much about politics when it comes to boxing or anything outside of the ring, um, not much at all. But um, especially with my community saying over and over again, you guys have reached out and it is my responsibility here to report this, um, uh, spread awareness um, and keep you guys informed about this. Showbiz the don't. Um, I will be on uh, tomorrow for Taco Tuesday. Maybe we can discuss this further and give you guys an update and speak boxing. Put some smiles. Uh, put some smiles on our faces. All right. I'm out. Huh.